And yes, it's time to abolish Zionism. This is where I'm going today. Just abolish Zionism. And until now, Amy, nobody has talked to me. Not the president, not the rector. All they do is they send letters and the letters are sent to uh, the media. The behavior of the university is a behavior that is threatening the safety of our students, the safety of uh, colleagues that are speaking against the genocide, and my own personal safety as a person who lives in Jerusalem and the safety of my family. The Hebrew University is highly militarized. Our students, I mean Jewish students, are walking around with rifles, with guns, and Palestinian students are extremely worried and, and fearful. Uh, to think through the lens of anti-Semitism is to remember never to frame any group or anybody as ontologically below being below a human. And that's exactly what Netanyahu, what Zionism is doing to the Palestinian. It's actually anti-Palestinianism and, uh, and anti-Semitism are, are, are very close. I explain in my book uh, on unchilding is that number one, our children are political capital in the hands of the state. The state looks at them and clearly defines them as non-children. They can be killed, they can be incarcerated. <laughs> I think we can definitely live together without the Zionist ideology that is about the life and livability of one group and the exclusion and the marginalization and death of the other group. Yeah.